morning, everyone. I'm Dora Aminata Kellogg. You see, I just downsized and moved from MHP's Edinburgh house to MHP newly opened Colonnade Apartments in Tacoma Park, Maryland. I'm, pro I'm profoundly grateful for the warmth and support I've found here. I'm here to share a piece of my life with you. A deeply personal story that is close to my heart. My story began in Sierra Leone, West Africa, where I was raised in a loving family. I venture out into the world, building my own family and the successful businesses. A pharmacy, a supermarket, and a store. Life was good, but in 1996, everything changed. While on my first visit to America, at the suggestion of my daughter, war broke out in my country, leaving me stranded here in Maryland. I face a hard choice certain death if I return, or uncertain path of sharing over in America. I chose the latter and began taking English courses and attending nursing school. Life, however, had challenges in store for me. My husband, still in Africa, died. I have major medical challenges and later financial ruin because I was unable to work. And then much later, in the midst of these hardships, I found love again and remarried. Mr. Kellogg and I faced life struggles together until illness took his ability to walk and we lost our home. Mr. Kellogg soon passed from the battle with cancer. With no home, I live by an old expression, to live by faith and not by sight. My minister heard about my hardship, told me about MHP, who lovingly helps me with housing I could afford. If I only depend on my narrow vision of life, I wouldn't have a hopeful story to share with you this morning. I'll be too defeated to even try. Looking at me, you could never know what I've been through. As another saying goes, all lizards lie flat on the ground, but you cannot tell the one suffering from stomach pain. My faith had allowed me to get back up and keep going. I thank the heavens that an organization like MAP exists, for even with my resourcefulness, I could never have imagined the life I have now, having been through so much. MHP didn't just help me, they saved me. Like a dying plant given life, I found hope. Staff like Ms. Brownette and so many others helped me, guide me through the process and kept me informed and encouraged. And to the power of community and kindness, I always believe in giving, even though I have little, because I know that kindness so today blooms into unexpected blessings tomorrow. I hope that whatever you can, you will give generously to MHP for its continued presence and programs. Life happens, 
and continues. Sometimes, despite our best efforts, we may find ourselves of need. From the bottom of my heart, thank you for being a part of my story, for helping me grow again. Together, let's continue to nurture hope and create opportunities for others. Thank you for listening, caring, and being a light of hope in the lives of people like me and so many others. Thank you. <laughs>